Welcome back, guys. So now we've got a review of the Dreamer car seat cushion. Is this $30 Amazon special with like 4,000 rating seat cushion very good? Let's find out. All right, so here we have it. <clears throat> the Dreamer car seat. Got it off of Amazon. It was about $30. I got it because I have a rip in my seat that I'm trying to keep from ripping even bigger. But also this is actually probably used for people who are height challenged, as they say. Let's go and get it unboxed. So it does come in this tube. That's really hard to get it out. And here it is. It comes in this nice, tight, airtight uh, seal. Um, get this unboxed, I'll be back in a second. All right guys, so here it is give you kind of a close-up that is what it looks like it does feel like a memory foam um, like I said that is how it is it has a seat in the back for your tailbone and I'm guessing this just straps around the back of the seat I've actually never bought a car cushion before so because I've never had a need for one. I don't have back issues, so I don't have any body issues at all. Um, so this is definitely just for the seat of the car. Again, uh, I will put a link to this in the description so you guys can see it. So with that said, I'm gonna go back to work. When I get home tonight, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, start trying this out. So with that said, be back in a minute. The first test is the office chair test with the wedge. I'm sure somebody is gonna be trying this, so let's try it for them. So you have to do this, because I actually had this at work today in the office chairs. They have the Aeron Gen 1s. I have the Gen 2, I actually done a review on this one. The Gen 1, uh, they're actually these, this is the C, so it's bigger. Gen 1's a little bit different. They're shaped, I feel like they're steeper on the sides, if I remember right. I mean, they definitely feel like it, but it's because they're smaller. But when I was at work, it felt like when I was sitting up and straight up and down, it just it felt like it was wanting me to fall out of the chair. Even when I was doing something, not paying attention to it, I never really felt that good about it. And the pressure points it puts through here, because it's still a wedge, you know, it puts pressure points through here. And when you try to lean back, it feels like you're doing this. You know, it feels like you're trying to fall out. So for an office chair, not gonna work. I put my 180 pound, six foot three co-worker and this in the office chair. He said it didn't compress much, but it wasn't too firm. He didn't care for it. In the car, again, with the seat design, it's gonna be perfectly fine. Speaking of that, in the car. In the car, it was, it was great. I wish it was a little bit firmer, but that's nitpicking. It was just fine, not probably 250, 260. It was just fine. So I didn't have an issue with the sliding around. Um, it's light, it's, it seems well built. So with that said, let me go ahead and use this for a week. I'll be back and uh, we'll, we'll wrap this review up. All right guys, as I say, it's been a week. It's actually been a week and a half, but sometimes I get busy. So <clears throat> to wrap the review of this wonderful cushion that I have that I cannot think of the name of because it's been a week and a half since I've looked at it. It's held up fine. I've been looking at it every couple of days because one of the complaints on it has been that it starts fraying on the top. I haven't had that issue. The worst that's happened, if you notice it's a little bit crooked, it does slide over a little bit like that, but that's not a big deal, of course. Um, I've never had them before, so I'm not sure if that's normal. I'm sure it is. But overall, I mean, how it does latch over the back of the seat. I don't know if you guys can see that because the ones are fogged over. But it's been nice. <clears throat> Visibility, I've gained about that that much. So it's not a huge difference. Basically, there's a difference between seeing the wipers. My hood is really slanted. So I can usually see the wipers, but I can see just about that much over it. So it's a little difference. I do wish it was a little bit taller, but overall, it's very comfortable. Uh, unless week and a half I've drove probably I live in the city so probably um, 400 miles maybe I've been a little bit of driving but not too much but 
yeah, overall, I think it's a pretty good uh, cushion. Not sure how long it'll last. I've only adjusted it one time, but when I put it in there, I didn't adjust it. I just fastened it. So with that said, if you got any questions for me, put it in the comments. If you wanted to review or try, in the comments. With that said, thank you guys for watching. You have a great night.